In addition, sometimes I do hear some distinction around the difference between feedback and coaching. So we thought we'd take a look at that. Now, when we talk about feedback generally, what we find is that we're looking at behaviors or things that have happened in the past, hence the term feedback, what, what's happened previously. Whereas when we talk about coaching, you're going to see us take a look at things more future oriented. Uh, in addition, when we talk about feedback, it can feel a little bit more reactive to something that's happened. Whereas coaching, ideally, is going to come across a little bit more proactive, thinking ahead, if you will. When we talk about feedback, it's not uncommon. We think about a little bit more of the one-way communication. I've got to share with you what I saw. Whereas with coaching, as we've already started to state, it's a little bit more two-way. So when feedback discussions occur, I might be in that role of teller just a little bit more. Whereas we take a look at a coaching role, you're going to see us really focus more on that role of asker and listener. And lastly, when we talk about feedback, usually what we're trying to do is redirect or reinforce behavior. I liken feedback to a professional GPS system that tells us either we're on the right road or perhaps we made a mistake and we've got a course correct. Whereas with coaching, it really is more developmental. And what we're really trying to do is encourage and bring out people's potential.